the kind of resourcefulness and even improvisational skills uh, that we hope people in the Barger Leadership Institute develop are exactly the kinds of skills that people have to have for the world that they're going to be entering. If you want to make change in the world and you see something that you are passionate about and you have to know something about it, you have a shot. I think, you know, certainly when I was going to school, it was more, you know, it was classroom setting. It wasn't so much about the extracurricular or out of classroom experiences. I mean, to the extent you have it today. One of the things that I've always thought was a problem is that while we treat our students really well, as long as they're in class and as long as we're working with them, we don't think about what they're going to do next. We need, we need some way of creating experiences for our students that really help them not only look forward to what's next in their lives, a big transition time, but also give them some experiences, a toe in the water, a chance to really feel that they've had an experience outside the classroom that makes sense to them. Of course, you can get into things like um, study abroad, and, uh, but I think it's, it's, it's the ability to get inside of an organization. It's the ability to go spend time at Ford Motor Company, or General Motors, or JWT, or uh, a JetBlue, or whatever. By the way, it might be for a day, it might be for two days, it might be for a week. But come on in and have access to how corporations, or nonprofits, or governmental agencies, whatever the case might be, how they're running now. I don't think we have to read about it in the case study. Let's go live it. If there were experiences that we could give our undergraduates that not only gave them some hands-on, real-life things to do, but place them in, in leadership roles, even in formal leadership roles, on both sides of leadership, both as givers of leadership and receivers of leadership. Wouldn't that make some sense as a kind of experience? But I just think the opportunity to talk through this, to have access to it, situational uh, type of settings, that's what the Institute, that's what these centers are really all about because they create some really interesting uh, just uh, settings that don't exist in a syllabus. You're just not gonna find them there. And in, it's only recently that learning has become more interactive, that it's more cooperative, that now at Michigan almost no undergraduate just sits and takes notes. They sit in teams and they work together. But, th but they're still sitting in a classroom. So breaking the wall between the classroom and the rest of the world is part of what the BLI is all about.